What's up everybody? Back again with another episode of Sneaker Sundays with your boy Kemi. This week's a very special week because we'll be doing two things. First of all, I just got a care package from my friends at Seoul in Toronto. For those of you who don't know what Seoul is, it's a sneaker repair company and they do cleanings, they do restorations, they sell all your sneaker needs in terms of laces, Angela's care products, and all accessories. So they just sent me a care package. We'll be doing an unboxing video of that and also I'll be showing you how to remove the soles of brand new Air Force Ones. So stay tuned, check out the video. So here we go guys. So I'll be putting this link in the description and I'll give you guys uh, everything you need to know. So first, wow, we have a little tote bag, you know, sole, it's their logo, very eco-friendly. We don't really use plastic bags in Canada anymore, so it's a little tote bag I can take. So wow, so we have sneaker shields. For those of you who don't know what this is, is uh, these are shields for your Air Force One, so you don't want no tote like you don't want the toe box crease and stuff like that. So if you don't want this crease, just put this in place. So sneaker shields. We got some scratch resistant sealer. This is something I've been looking for for years in Canada. I couldn't really find this. So I normally order this from the States, which is like crazy duties, crazy import fees, and a little costly with the exchange rate. So I can buy this locally. This is truly a blessing. We have a few Angela's Too Thin. Very common, this is what I use for my airbrush. I do all my airbrushing work with this stuff. Too Thin. Always need your white paint. So these guys supply all the Angela's paint within Canada as well too. So I love supporting local. Cheaper, quick, simple to use. Got some black paint. They supply all my paint needs. They gave me an empty paint bottle, which I like to use sometimes to squeeze that on. And also, these are nice guys, man. Just give me some Angela stickers. I put this on your fridge or like wherever you keep them in your office. A few more stickers. These are really cool soul stickers. Yeah, and some postcards and stuff like that. And so thank you. So thank you guys at Soul. Thank you so much. And I'll put their link in the description everything. So stay tuned, check it out. So the first step in the removal of the sole is to remove the insoles right here. So these are the insoles removed. And then after that, you're gonna take your shoe and you're gonna pour some acetone inside this and let it sit for 20 minutes. So this is the first step in removing the sole. You must remove the white thread holding the midsole in place. So now that the thread holding the mid tool is gone, this is going to be the hardest part. So you're going to need a flathead screwdriver, an X-Acto knife, and a heat gun. And we're going to use those to remove the mid tool itself. So we're going to be using the heat gun on the flathead screwdriver to heat it up. So after that, the flathead screwdriver will help us release the midsole 
I'm melting the glue holding it in place. 